Our company is a new company. Uh, the project has been in existence for a long time. We've been doing this for a number of years. We have built, Airbus has built a beautiful plane called Zephyr. And uh, uh, a little bit early or in the middle of uh, 2022, uh, Airbus spun off uh, the company uh, to develop a services business. And this company now has a name, it's called Alto. And MWC is the launch of Alto is where we launch our brand, our company, our services business, and is, when, when, is one where we start engaging with our core customer group, which is the mobile operators and the tower companies. MNOs and tower companies struggle to connect the unconnected because uh, it just happens that the economics and the difficulties, the challenges, the technical difficulties of connecting the rural and remote communities are high. Uh, the population densities are not high enough usually to justify for the MNOs to extend terrestrial connectivity. So what with Zephyr, what we would do is we give a solution that allows the MNOs not only to do uh, something that technically is difficult, but also to do it while being profitable, which is extending the coverage to rural and remote areas. We have not started our deployment yet. We are a company that has uh, a new technology that is now mature. And unlike any other HAPS player in the world, HAPS is a new industry. It's a new way of providing mobile connectivity. So, uh, you know, traditional methods include maybe terrestrial towers and satellite. HAPS is something completely new that has not come to the market yet. And today, uh, we uh, at Alto, we have the most mature HAPS program. The only one with an with a aircraft that has flown in the stratosphere overnight, and we have done that for 64 days uh, in a row last year. So the plan is, when you have that sustainability, the ability to fly for many days in a, or many months at a time, then you can provide service consistently over a certain location. Uh, so today what we are doing is, we have finalized the design of the plane, we're building the services business around it, we're getting the certifications in place, and by the end of next year, we will be launching commercial service. Airbus created uh, Alto to be a services business. You know, Airbus is in the business of, of, of selling aircraft, producing and selling aircraft. We are developing uh, a mobile connectivity and an earth observation uh, services business. That's what Alto is about. Uh, it uses Zephyr, our, our star performer, which is here at the uh, MWC. The aircraft that you see at MWC has flown multiple missions, two of them of 14 days uh, in the stratosphere. It has broken one record after another for, for unmanned flights, 64 days last year. What's so beautiful about this is that this is all green technology. It's sustainable, it's emissionless, so the, basically the aircraft flies uh, on the power of the sun, it charges its batteries during the day for night flight, it's completely emissionless. So when we offer a service like this that really improves people's lives and, and, and saves people's lives, we are doing it not at the cost to the planet. We are doing it with no cost to the planet. We are doing it while respecting the future of the planet. It's completely uh, in line with the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals, very aligned. So what's ahead? We're gonna be launching service by the end of next year. Today, we're engaging with our customers, with the MNOs in particular, and the tower companies, to work with them on where they need to cover. What are those communities that they really need to go after and cover and make sure that they're connected and they have the same services that they have uh, uh, that are available in urban areas.